What's up everybody, Logan here, Stock Investor, aka Crypto Investor, back with another video. Today we're going over the Art Gobbler's Goo token. Ticker symbol is Goo, G-O-O. -O. Uh, this token is <laughs> sitting at 3,000, no, what? 3 million, $30,117, it says is the token price, according to CoinGecko. This token just got listed on CoinGecko, brand new listing, it's right at the very top, and it is up 141.1% since being listed here on CoinGecko, doing very well. Uh, this is an Ethereum token, we're going to go over the information on this token and how you can get it in just one second, but before we do that, just quickly, I am not a financial advisor, this is not financial advice, I'm not telling you to buy this token or anything like that. This is strictly just information. Take it with a grain of salt. Always do your own research first before investing in anything, especially crypto, because crypto can be very volatile. Also, there is a ton of referral codes down there in the description box. Have a look at those. Best referral codes for the best crypto apps. You can get yourself free money, free rewards, free crypto, things like that. Just by using those referral codes down there and funding your account, it's real simple. Referral codes benefit both of us, so check them out in the description box. And let's get into this token here. So, according to their Ether scan here, this must be like a super brand new token, like just came out because um, they it's up 141%, which is a decent amount. And then I'm looking at their Ether scan, and it says they only have 80 holders so far. Uh, 419 transfers, 18 decimal places, and it says max total supply of this token is 0 0.1216, and then a whole bunch of numbers after that. So they they barely have a tenth of a token, and that's why their token price. That's why it's like over three million dollars for one token. Uh, so if you divide that up. I mean, that's very strange the way they did that, but it's, it's, that's like the exact opposite of what crypto does. You know, like Shiba Inu, they have, you know, uh, trillions of coins or quadrillions or whatever it is, right? Um, or I forget the exact number. Uh, but um, yeah, so they make it look like you're, you have a lot of tokens. This token is the exact opposite. You get like a, fr a very small fraction of a token, um, you know, even, even smaller than Bitcoin, because Bitcoin sitting at what around uh 28,000 Canadian so you know and then this is at 3 million <laughs> over 3 million 3 million 30,000 even the 30,000 is bigger than than bitcoin without even the 3 million uh but yeah so you you have a very small fraction uh but a lot of a lot of trades going on just recently 2 minutes ago 4 minutes ago 5 minutes ago 6 minutes ago 7 minutes ago 9 that's how i know this token is very brand new because it's up a lot, there's only 80, 80 holders, and basically all the transactions look like they just happened, according to their Ether scan. You can also see their chart on uh, CoinGecko here. Obviously, the 24-hour chart is very similar uh, to the, well, the seven-day chart is just a steady incline here. It looks like it's probably a couple days old, uh, but yeah, so... Artgobblers.com is their official webpage. You can find that listed on CoinMarketCap. Uh, you can find their contract address. Twitter's listed on here. Um, Etherscan, price chart, all that stuff. So you can get this token off of Uniswap. That's where everybody's getting it off of right now. Now, if you go over to their official webpage, they have what's called a green paper. You can click on that. It's going to give you lots of information. It's just like a white paper. Art Gobblers is a decentralized art factory owned by aliens. As artists make cool art, gobblers gain cultural relevant, re, relevance, making collectors want to art more, incentivizing artists to make cooler art. It is also an on-chain game. Art Gobblers are called Art Gobblers because they gobble art. Pretty straightforward. In particular, they eat art that artists draw using our art tools, and turn into one-to-one uh, one -one NFTs using in-game resources. All the artworks uh, a art gobbler eats belong to it on-chain and are displayed in its belly gallery forever. This is a, actually a cool idea. You can see all the pictures on their uh, green paper and on their webpage too of all the aliens in the artwork. It's super cool. 
Uh, art gobblers produce goo tokens, which are used to produce the blank pages needed to make art. Gobblers love the smell of their own goo, so the more goo they have in their goo tanks, the faster they squirt out more goo. The supply of goo grows faster every day, starting at hundreds and eventually reaching billions and beyond. So the game can't be balanced by giving them fixed prices in goo. Instead, a mechanism called VRGDA automatically adjusts prices over time to target a desired uh, insurance schedule, adjusting prices up when sales are ahead of schedule and down when sales are behind schedule. The protocol targets the initial blank page VRGDA assurance rate of 69 per day to foster experimentation, but eventually slows down to a constant 10 per day to ensure a high bar and focused attention for the community. The initial uh, gobbler mint consists of 2,000 fully animated gobblers. Over the next 10 years, players will spend goo to mint 8,000 more gobblers using VRGDA. Assurance is relatively fast and at first to bootstrap growth, but slows and eventually stops to preserve exclusive, exclusive, exclusivity. <laughs> These systems can lead to some interesting gameplay as players must decide when to trade goo for gobblers, changing the VRGDA price for everyone else, legendary gobblers, Goos, goo boosting one to one uh, that can only be obtained by burning huge numbers of regular uh, gobblers encourage large scale collaboration. So the intentions, the mechanism behind uh, the mechanisms making up the art gobblers experiment will be the final at the time of mint, and no more will be built. They are intended to power a self-sustaining ecosystem capable of creating and collecting the coolest art in the universe without the need for human intervention. We hope as artists to make cool art, the cultural rele relevance of art gobblers will grow. As cultural relevance grows, art gobblers uh, will hold higher demand for collectors, and as artists see higher collector demand, they will produce cooler art. Gobble on! So art gobblers exist to facilitate the creation and collection of the coolest art in the universe. Artists can create hand-drawn art using draw tools, uh, which works on the desktop, iPad, or uh, Cintiq. They have been making some pretty cool stuff already. So you can actually see some artworks on the page here. Uh, so as Goo, as described in the Goo paper, is an ERC-20 Ethereum token emitted by Art Gobbler's NFTs. Because Goo is needed to make the blank pages, Art Gobbler's ultimately determine what art can be created in the ecosystem and in that way serve as co-curators of a decentralized art gallery. Goo can also be used to create new gobblers, giving players an interesting set of strategic uh, decisions that we will discuss further in details in uh, a different section. So you can check all that out. So it says there is no roadmap as of now. Uh, so maybe there'll be one in the future. And uh, it says total goo over time, and it looks like it goes up. So maybe this is an inflationary token. Uh, let's see here. Hoarding goo tokens without owning any gobbler NFTs is a very bad strategy as everyone else will be generating goo and your share of your total goo supply will rapidly dwindle to nothing. Okay, so it's a good idea to get one of these NFTs. I see a lot of people buying this goo token right now on uh, on Etherscan, or according to the Etherscan there, uh, buying it off Uniswap. So it says eventually it'll dwindle to nothing. Uh, obviously, there could be a big pump and dump right off the bat here because that's what happens a lot when tokens get their initial listing. But it says the best uh, strategy is to own one of these NFTs and basically collect goo over time. And uh, yeah, so check out this huge paper, though. It's going to explain everything in more detail. This video is running a little long here. Uh, but yeah, check out the NFTs. Look pretty cool, too. You can find this on CoinGecko. And you can find their webpage at artgobblers.com. And you can find them on Twitter at artgobblers. Now, I am not a financial advisor, so why don't you guys let me know in the comment section down below. What do you guys think about this token? Do you think this is a good investment or not? 
Make sure you guys like this video, subscribe for daily crypto videos where I go over the newest coins and tokens and what their info and utility is. And check out all the referral codes down there in the description box and get yourself some free crypto. Before we wrap this video up here, I'd just like to tell you about today's sponsor, the Beehive Multi-Token Crypto Wallet. It's an easy to navigate wallet with low listing fees, low outgoing fees, quick sign in with added optional TFA for added security. It offers 24 hour support. The wallet supports a ton of coins like Dogecoin, Dingo Coin, Bitcoin, etc. The wallet offers earning features as well, such as Beehive staking and masternodes. All links to the Beehive wallet, including the download link, will be pinned to the top of the comment section down there. So make sure you check it out. Amazing wallet, the Beehive wallet. Thanks for watching, everybody. Y'all have a great day out there. Peace.